हेलो अस्सलाम वालेकुम नमस्ते वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल टुडे आई क्रिएटेड दिस मेकअप लुक एंड आई कैन यूज ऑलमोस्ट दैट टाइप ऑफ मेकअप दैट आई हैव बट The skin tone is slightly different, but not as different. But uh, the face giving a shadow here that was looking a lot of uh, discoloration. But I don't have a lot, lot discoloration. You can see the foundation have pretty. 
like my skin is peeking through but i can say that it somehow covered a lot of thing and one thing is that is foundation doesn't set as quickly because i forgot to uh, blend the patch here and it, it is easily blendable after a quite time also and the foundation i can say it is a pretty decent finish like a, it is giving me a natural finish and not so dramatically like a, giving me a good coverage that i need for day to do day to day foundation and it is perfectly matching me so perfectly even there is no in a single place that i feeling that my skin doesn't matching to this foundation color and i really like the coverage it has somehow matte i can it is not proper matte it is dammy matte and in summer it is pretty walkable foundation now for concealer i don't know it is uh, a good coverage concealer or a bad coverage concealer and please ignore that it is little sweating that the cream product always have uh, it's showing me little sweating that i'm not worry about so it have a decent color for my skin tone that is little darker to my skin tone but it can be used as proper corrector because for correcting my skin you can see it is little darker but i am not applying a lot because for correction you don't need a lot of to show different cast on skin pretty blendable i really enjoy it a lot and this shade is pretty i do it doesn't give me a lot of coverage for that i use diff i will use different for concealer for that one the this one it's perfectly covered a slightly I can see that if this is matching my skin so perfect and I can see it's not full coverage thing or it is I can see that it is towards medium or less than medium but it is good for correcting you can easily use this shade for correction and now I'm using same brush and taking darker shade as my contour see yeah, now it's matching me perfectly because little contouring the freedom uh, pro conceal palette and this variant is medium hash dark and that is pretty matching shades for my skin tone i really enjoy this but i can say it not is a full coverage or medium coverage product it is only for able to correct the things not for sake of proper uh, like you can easily use as uh, skin correctors and contouring because for contouring you don't need a lot of uh, to apply and for correcting you don't need a, a lot of angled brush for that because it easily blind the color here oh you can see that it have the foundation have a little glossy finish and i i am oily skin type and i sweat a lot on my skin so this is the good foundation for my skin type and for blending everything
foundation or powder foundation or compact i i'm using this l'oreal's mac magic all in one compact in and six nude honey a little sponge and pretty pigmented product giving me matte finish and pretty best match to my skin i really like this foundation that have a like liquid version of this a uh, mag magic foundation i really love it but the l'oreal one this continued tight foundation is pretty good coverage foundation and it's such a long lasting foundation that was my first foundation that i bought i really like that foundation a lot and wow it is pretty good matte wow uh i can see slightly discoloration here and here for day to day life you don't need to apply a lot of product on like under eyes and i need a tiniest hair hair portion my inner corner otherwise i don't want a lot of coverage for my skin uh, concealer i am using this revolution fast base concealer in shade c9 that is a light concealer a light concealer for my skin tone it can be used as highlighting concealer just here i want that coverage here only here and i don't want a lot of coverage but that is you can see giving me a flawless matte finish now i'm i'm i use this uh, twice or thrice but still i'm not feeling that i really like it um one thing is that it is not mattifying powder so you can ignore the fact that it is a mattifying prime uh, powder it is name is black me 95 natural and second thing is that it have only one color uh, india have a lot of color the uh, color but still the girl is making one color for all the like there is multiple of colors minimum to minimum we should have to five to six shades for this compact because it is smoothing compact uh, no sorry loose powder not compact but you have to make a different color for different skin tone i i am like a nc th 40 or 42 in summer but it's like matching me perfectly but what about the people who are duskier than to me that is a little bummer for them revolution makeup revolution um, what its name is unite unicorn palette i bought this uh, around last year something and i haven't used it then and i keep it for the sake like i will use some day but i don't have a got chance for that so i am first using this shade for setting my lid you can see the upper row is uh, matte and remaining two rows are the sh shimmer it is have a good coverage pigmentation of the good pigmentation because it and the shade is true, true matching shade to my skin too so let start it um, this one i am using this one because that is little darker than the remaining one like a like a 
gray and plum mix shade and this is smooth I really like this now trying to make that trend is like I'm using that same shade but this tiny it's a little angular lip brush I can say but it can be used as a smudge eyeliner used to create a smudge eyeliner because it's not giving me as perfect or defined lines so I don't want that and I'm little extended here I'm not like dragging up that is the entrance is so good but why you make so much effort just follow your lines your definitions and just make it work what you already have don't worry about what you don't have just worry about what you already have uh, I really like that it is giving me good definition and I am following that same here I am literally applying like under eye so eyeshadow after a really long time I I was using just one stroke brown kajal or any lip pencil uh, lip brown pencil because that is such a pigment and I can see I don't have a, a lot of fallout I don't see any fallout what I'm feeling it I'm feeling this shade and the, these two shade or I should skip any shade on my skin it's have a pigmentation I can say but it is pretty smooth good pigmentation is good I can say pigmentation is on point that was this palette and I can say you then you can see the pigmentation is on point but I can say this type of sh you don't need to buy this palette because this this palette cost me three thirteen hundred fifty why you get this palette if you easily got this type of shade in wet and white palette or um, Nikake palette that recently bought in under 500 so you got same type of shade in that palette so like Nika palettes or that type of uh, palette so you better get or get those palette because that costs a lo lot lesser than this so but I really enjoy that it create the look I'm thinking to apply this because I one thing is that it is not pigmented product you have to apply a little layer to apply and I quite like that thing right, right now but for the girls who want a, a lot of pigment and a lot of definition you better skip it because in um, 600 you better get best ones in the price of this see there is a not lot of change applying this kajal or not kajal was absolute beauty perfect wear kajal waterproof 
and this shade is Aklan. I'm thinking I don't want to apply any of the like uh, foundation. I, it's feeling little tacky but I can work it because um, don't want any type of uh, uh, like uh, powder to mattify it because when it give leave that is glowy thing that I want next uh, soft matte lip cream in shade uh, San Francisco of uh, San Francisco I don't the pronunciation sorry I'm little I don't get some words and I'm using this as my brush it is pretty peachy shade I'm taking the angle brush this is the wet and wild one and I'm taking the same color that I used this one in my eyebrow so slightly because it is such a pigmented and this is not a eyebrow color it is it is eyeshadow so you better keep a little soft headed on this this shade is giving me little red tone you can see it so but my calm to chill gear like that so that is done this is giving me a lot of natural natural cover I have pretty much full brow here I don't end here so I only applied little bit of color here in my inner corner that I applied with that color mm, well, I want some type of brightness for that I'm using this this is a uh, wet and wild makeup contouring palette and in shade is caramel toffee it has this highlighting shade and this a bronzing one so I'm applying a bronzer I just like one two just that why you apply a lot of product if you don't want that lot of product just use tiniest amount for that why you need a lot of product for for the first sake just apply tiny like use soft head one thing I can show you that from the ears that I have learned that soft hand give the perfect finish apply lot of things heavy handed things lot of foundation concealer uh, like lot of things don't you look pretty just give you that give you I don't feel nowadays I don't really love a lot of coverage thing right, right now tiniest coverage just make me balance even out that I want I don't want any of full coverage uh, more defined thing for my face uh, for my eyes or for my lips I do, really don't like recently so you can see that my face look good even bronze uh, contoured face and I use tiniest product of each I am using this side this is pretty pigmented product and you don't need a lot of product you can see it's giving me so much color that I really don't want I am thinking to apply a 
highlighter but now I'm feeling I want it or I don't want it because recently I'm not even I'm using these two this is the instant glow from uh, instant glow uh, instant glow shimmer brick from in color and the shade is nectar I become opposite what I was using that time I'm taking first and here like that it is your preference in a starting my like I will start doing makeup from 2016 before that I really don't do really don't know what is the lipstick was what is eyeliner was what is uh, foundation was I really don't know that time I really start doing makeup from 2016 and uh, I really don't know I even don't know what was BB cream before my like 12 I really don't have any makeup product that time I only had one kajal that I pretty obsessed with because I I love to wear kajal on daily purposes in my 9th and 10th not in 11th earth. but after that I really become slight like that I used to do a lot of kajal like I love to apply a kajal but after that I really don't feel that much then and I had a lip balm like I had the colored lip balm sometimes from Nivea, sometimes from uh, Maybelline and whatever that I had. I only applied that at a kajal. That was my makeup that time. After uh, my like lay, uh, like end of 2015, I bought BB cream that time and one lipstick, right? That was red lipstick. And after that, I don't even wear any type of like heavy coverage foundation and everything um then i went to my cousin's wedding in pakistan uh, so what was that key uh, that uh, from that i wear some colors like a uh, heavy color red lipstick and then after that i start doing makeup and even not that time i have starting using bb Cream. That time I start using BB cream, not even a foundation for uh, uh, daily wear or for friends out. I uh, I was using just BB cream that time. That is, I was in like, I was 18 that time. And now the children are doing makeup from beginning of their life. I feel so like little worried from them because. Kya new hoga jab unki age pochegi jab tak. I'm using this uh, Masaba collection and Lakme. And this shade is um, uh, like bubble, bubble gum, bubble pink. I was maniac in 2017. I used to do lot of dramatic makeup like glitter eyeshadows. Uh, I had a glitter eyeliner that I used as eyeshadow. I I have still, but I'm not loving that thing right right now. So that type was kaya. Kete na vak tha kar liya ab nahi karne ka man karta. So I start stop using that and I am using this it is uh, Maybelline uh, Maybelline creamy matte lipstick in shade clay crush to lighten this shade because yes imagine aura and I love popping one thing like either eyes or either lips so done 